Hello everyone, this is your sensei, Joe Lau, and this is the Fire Dojo. problem is it's obviously not flexible so we would need to separate the fibers to make it flexible so as an example what I've done here is in the front of my house I have wisteria vine that grows and it's a kind of a woody vine it has excellent tensile strength and what I'm going to do is is set it up for you to show you because it's not very flexible. I mean, I couldn't wrap this around a cordage as flexible. But if we separate the fibers, now in the personality of the wisteria, it has a, a woody core that looks like a, a pencil lead. And you want to take that out of there out of the center. Now you're, you're left with these fibers and what you do with these fibers is you reverse wrap them. Okay, And here are the fibers separating. Kind of looks like sinew if you've actually ever seen sinew come off an animal. It has that kind of quality. Look at all that nice fiber. And then what we would do is work this whole thing down, reverse wrap it after we clean it up a little bit, okay, and turn it into something like this. Now, again, unfortunately, this whole thing, is, this is a course on friction fire. It's not on stone tools and cordage making and plant and tree identification. But I'm going to show you as a demonstration this natural cordage of yucca on a bow drill. Okay, so we're going to do that now. 